Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to RC Bassin. Today we're going to talk to you about waterproof bags. So have you ever been out on the boat getting ready to take a trip and you're looking for a place to stick all your pocket contents, your wallet, your keys, your glasses, um, other miscellaneous items that you don't want to misplace, knock over the side of the boat, sink to the bottom of the water, or you just don't want them to get wet, it's going to rain or a heavy dew morning. Well, today we're going to talk to you about a solution that our friends over at Runkle Tackle sent over to us to check out. And it's the Runkle Waterproof Bag. Hold on, we'll be right back. All right, as I said, our friends over at Runkle Tackle sent over one of their waterproof bags for us to check out here on RC Bassin. Um, and they sent us over the smaller bag. Um, they asked which one we wanted to try out. I told them the smaller one would be fine. Um, maybe we'll try out some of the larger ones in, in a different video later on. So that's the box that it came in. And so um, two pieces of contents in the back in the uh, box. One was a waterproof phone case with a, with a neck lanyard. Uh, these are pretty standard. I think everyone's probably seen these, but this one has a seal on the top. And again, it comes with a lanyard you hang around your neck. Um, let's pop it open here. So it's got the clips at the top that pop open. Slide your phone down in there. It's got a lamp neck lanyard that comes with it. And then you've got your phone waterproof. And actually this case floats as well. Um, so I've used some other cases like this and they actually float. So pretty nice. All right. Next is the actual waterproof bag. Now, when I saw this bag, I liked it. One, for the color, because it stands out. You know, it's not gonna be hard to, uh, to locate um, day or night. You know, you're probably gonna see this. Um, it does have a little bit of reflective uh, lining around one of the zippers. And it's in a couple of different spots on the bag, so that kind of helps you find it in low light conditions. It has a, just a standard carrying strap, throw it over your shoulder. Um, or carry it by the strap and then the bag itself just seemed to be about the right size so when you're filling contents in the bag you want to stay just below the, the closure line at the top because um, you want to fold the bag over and then of course you want to buckle it so the top is closed right so you just want to fill it above or just below the uh, the closure line. You've got a nice outside mesh pocket here. You know if you want to stick something inside there. And you could probably get a sweatshirt in here. It's got a reinforced bottom too, which is pretty nice. So you can see the bottom's got a reinforced pad on it. You got your hooks on the side. You can hang extra accessories onto the side of it. So if you want to clip the keys or something on it or anything else water bottle something like that you could clip on and here's the buckle for your uh, shoulder carrying straps on the bottom and on the top of the bag um, so again it just seemed big enough you know you can stick a sweatshirt in there rain jacket maybe a complete rain suit and then you can dr drop other stuff inside the bag like you know like your wallet um, sunglasses these are some solar bats so I wouldn't want to lose those you know, a small flashlight or something you know, if you had your phone in the carrying case, you could drop that in there. Your keys, maybe a pocket knife, something to cut line with. You know, whatever else you want to stick in there. And you can see that this is the smaller of the three bags. You've got a 10 liter, 20, and a 30 liter. And um, not very much room taken up in the bag. So plenty of room in this bag, very sturdy bag. It's really thick material. Um, just the right size for me and my boat. And uh, I'm sure Runkle has something in their line of waterproof bags to, to fit your needs as well. So head over to Runkle Tackle and check them out. It's R-U-N-C-L, born to win. Runkle Tackle, thank you very much for sending this over to RC Bassin and letting us have an opportunity to check it out. Great product. And um, that's about all I have for you today. I know it's a short video. Just another tip uh, for you to, to keep your content safe and dry and make your fishing experience a little bit more enjoyable. Um, again, head over to Runkle Tackle, check out their products. Uh, you won't be disappointed. All right, folks, until we get to meet again.
stay safe, take care, tight lines, hook them up.